the altitude is tough, but so worth it. How you feel? Cheers. Cheers. Well done guys. Hey, I'm Kieran and this is my better half Maddie. We both decided to leave the UK at the start of 2023 to follow our dreams and go travelling full time. This is our Nepal series. Good morning, it's half four and today we are completing the Tarong Pass which is the highest point of our track. Um, it's going to be a long day, we have to walk about 10. 11 hours. How are you feeling? Yeah, I'm feeling good. It's pretty tough. It's slow going because of the high altitude. Um, I think it's going to take us about three to four hours to get to the peak, which is just over 5,400 meters. Um, some of our friends just had to turn back because he wasn't feeling so well. He was feeling sick and they're going to try and acclimatize for today and then try again tomorrow. So that's the reality of it. But yeah, I think we're both feeling good at the moment, so we're going to take our time and uh, yeah, hopefully get there. And then we've got a long 1,700 metres down and the end destination is Muktana, so fingers crossed we make it. So we have just stopped for a little breakfast break. Um, Kieran's gone for a porridge. Yeah, so I've got some porridge uh, with some peanut butter that I've put in. Good energy. Um, it's crazy that they have a tea house here, like, uh, I don't know how high we, up we are now, but we must be about 5,000 metres. So you can imagine it'd be tricky to get all the stuff up. Um, and for the person working, it's absolutely freezing. Yeah, it's really, really, really cold today. Today's the first day we're wearing <coughs> our down jackets whilst walking. Hmm. But yeah, it's, it's really, really cold. My toes are freezing, so I had to put another socks on. Jam jam, one last uphill. We have made it. We've got to the top of the Tarangla Pass, 5,450 meters. And we are up. That was challenging, not gonna lie. Uh, the altitude is tough, but so worth it. Um, Maddie's just behind me. She'll be here any moment, but I feel so happy because probably one of the biggest achievements. Really, really difficult. You made it. You okay? How you feel? Emotional, right? You feel proud though. Yeah. But you did it, so that's the main thing. High five. Well then, you should feel very proud. Mr. Dalbat, you made it. High five. Best guide in Nepal. Well then, Roshan, how was it for you? It was tough, but it was good. Yeah, he's done it before and he's been to 6,000 meters, but even for you it was difficult, right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well done, though. You did very well and you, you helped us a lot. So thank you. Thank you. One last pass. We made it. So we are 5,416 meters up. Amazing. Well then, Kieran. Thank you, Russian. We could not have done it without you. So after nine days of walking, we finally made it to the summit. Yeah. 5,416 meters. What was the toughest thing, Maddie? Today. Today, yeah. Today was really, really tough. Mentally, physically. Like, you, you feel fatigued, tired. Um, hard to breathe for me, yeah. So. Yeah, I think definitely the altitude made today really tricky. Also, I, I did the ice lake with my guide, which was also really tricky because it was completely uphill and then back down. Uh, but yeah, the altitude made today a very difficult. But such a nice feeling getting to the top, seeing everyone come on big smiles on their faces so yeah i'm really happy and we did so well yeah this is a big 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 achievement for me because there was some parts i don't think i was going to make it so very happy very ramble we have been up here for about an hour now it's time to go down 
it's pretty cold so when you're not moving yeah you definitely feel the cold because it's super windy here but they've got like a little tea house which is really nice so you can maybe fit i don't know up to 20 people in there and they've got hot drinks so we enjoyed a, a little hot drink and a relaxing time in there we have just started going down now we have to go down 1700 meters uh, to Muktanaf, which can take anywhere between three to five hours and uh, yeah going down can be quite challenging but uh, I've got my crampons on because it's pretty icy so that's helping a lot the We have made it to Muktanaf we're just gonna go try find the hotel where everyone is planning on staying but there's something going on that's some like a religious festival or something. I think Mogdana is a big Hindu community. We have just found our hotel. It's called Bob Marley. Where do we go in? Which way is the entrance? I think this way. Look at the view. It's amazing. Some much needed food has just arrived. What have you got, Maddie? Well, well-deserved Italian pasta. I've not tried it yet, so hopefully it's good because I need some really good food because for the past couple of days we've been getting the same menu everywhere we go, so getting this is really nice. Yeah, a bit of variety is always good. So she's gone for the arrabbiata and I have the burrito, but it's a funny-looking burrito, this. Burrito? Yeah, I've never seen a burrito come out like that, but looks very good and I'm starving so I'm sure I'll enjoy it. Oh. Cheers. Cheers! Well done guys.